Hello, tech explorers. Welcome back to the channel where we decode the future. And for our newcomers, we're your ultimate guide to all things cutting edge, from AI to cybersecurity. If you haven't yet, be sure to hit the subscribe button and ring that notification bell so you're always in the loop. Today, we're navigating uncharted waters, a darker corner of the AI universe known as WormGPT. This new development has the cybersecurity world on high alert, and we're about to delve into why. Imagine a program that takes the power of AI and weaponizes it for cybercrime. That's what WormGPT is, a sinister offshoot of ChatGPT, designed to arm cybercriminals with advanced AI capabilities. And astonishingly, its creator is openly selling access to it on popular hacking forums. First detected in July 2023, WormGPT is now being sold on the dark web for a whopping $1,000. It's based on the GPT-3 language model and is essentially a content-generating powerhouse, equipped to fabricate not just text, but images and attachments too. Well, there's customer service and then there's cybercriminal customer service, right? Now what sets WormGPT apart from its counterparts like ChatGPT or Google's Bard is its lack of moral compass. It's an AI genie that grants every illicit wish. It doesn't just provide support for black hat hackers, it's an active participant, allowing users to orchestrate an array of illegal activities all from the comfort of their own homes. But what exactly does WormGPT do? How does it work? And most importantly, how can we protect ourselves against this new threat? Stick around as we unravel this digital enigma. You see, WormGPT is not just a tool, it's a tutor. It's been trained on data about malware creation, and the results are concerning. WormGPT can fabricate malware written in Python, offer tips on constructing malicious attacks, and even design highly convincing BEC emails. Imagine receiving an email that looks legitimate in every way, right from the logo to the language. But hidden within it is a digital Pandora's box, waiting to unleash chaos at the click of a button. This is just the tip of the iceberg. Worm GPT has much more up its sleeve, and we're going to delve into all of it. So, whether you're a tech enthusiast or just someone who wants to stay safe online, this video is a must-watch. Remember, we hold the power to defend ourselves and our digital world against such threats. Knowledge is our best defense, and today, we're arming you with exactly that. Stay tuned, because we've got a lot more to uncover. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. It's your support that keeps us going. Now let's delve deeper into the abyss of WormGPT. The developer used GPTJ, an older but still potent language model from 2021, training it specifically on data concerning malware creation. Want to cook up some malware written in Python? WormGPT's got you covered. Need tips on crafting malicious attacks? WormGPT can assist. According to Slashnext, an email security provider that tested the program, WormGPT was able to write an email for a business email compromise or BEC scheme, a type of phishing attack. The results? Unsettling. WormGPT created an alarmingly persuasive and strategically cunning email potentially perfect for sophisticated phishing and BEC attacks. Just so we're on the same page, Business Email Compromise, BEC, is a type of phishing attack where attackers pretend to be someone you trust in order to trick you into handing over sensitive information or even transferring money. And WormGPT has been built to perfect these BEC attacks. It can generate lifelike email content, right down to text, images, and even attachments. With its help, Attackers can create tailored BEC email templates for specific victims or organizations. This implies two things. Firstly, these scams are now more likely to succeed. The more genuine the email appears, the easier it is to fall prey. Secondly, WormGPT enables cybercriminals to rapidly upscale their BC attacks, generating a multitude of scam emails to be shot out to numerous victims. Scary, isn't it? Beyond creating convincing BEC emails and generating malware, WormGPT presents a slew of other risks to both individuals and organizations. Let's break them down. Identity theft and fraud. Firstly, the highly realistic communication generated by WormGPT can facilitate identity theft and fraud. 
It can impersonate real individuals and organizations, leading victims to share sensitive personal information or execute transactions under false pretenses. Automated Social Engineering With its advanced language generation capabilities, Worm GPT could automate social engineering attacks on a large scale. It can craft persuasive messages to trick users into giving out sensitive information or taking actions that compromise their cybersecurity. Rapidly Evolving Threats The flexibility and adaptability of Worm GPT's AI means it can quickly learn and evolve to create new types of threats, making it a moving target for cybersecurity professionals. Increased Accessibility to Cybercrime Tools since Worm GPT can be purchased on the dark web, it democratizes access to advanced cybercrime tools. This means even novice hackers with malicious intent could get their hands on it. Deepfakes and disinformation. With Worm GPT's content generation capabilities, it's not a far reach to assume it could be used to create convincing deepfakes or disinformation campaigns, contributing to the spread of fake news and other deceptive content. As we can see, the risks of Worm GPT go well beyond email phishing. It has the potential to wreak havoc on a grand scale, from personal identity theft to the propagation of mass disinformation. This is a serious wake-up call about the future of cybercrime. As AI tools advance, the complexity and sophistication of cyber attacks are bound to increase, making it harder for individuals and businesses to safeguard themselves. But here's some good news. There are ways to defend yourself and your business against BEC attacks. Be skeptical of emails from unknown senders. Avoid clicking on links or opening attachments from unfamiliar sources. If an email seems suspicious, contact the sender directly to confirm its legitimacy. Keep your software updated, use a robust password manager, and stay informed about the latest BEC scams. By adopting these protective measures, we can all play our part in combating cybercrime. We're seeing an AI that's similar to ChatGPT, but with zero ethical boundaries or limitations. This underlines the significant threat posed by generative AI technologies like WormGPT, even when wielded by amateur cyber criminals. Still, WormGPT's existence is a grim reminder of how generative AI programs could fuel cybercrime as they mature but it's also a wake-up call for security professionals and AI developers alike to keep one step ahead, building better defenses and creating AI with ethical safeguards in mind. That wraps up today's episode. We hope you found it informative and helpful. Remember, knowledge is power and staying informed is our first line of defense. If you enjoyed the video, give us a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe. Until next time, stay safe and stay curious.